Hi students. Okay, today in this lecture we learning the topic is partial differential equation reducible to standard forms. In the previous lecture we completed standard form converted to the standard form type one. So this is a type two one. So in the type two the equation of the form equations of the form f of z power n p comma z power n into q is equal to zero or f of x comma z power n p is equal to function g of y comma z power n q and the z power n p z power n q now eliminating here z power n p z power n q and then place lo capital p and capital p replacing so how to convert it to the standard form this is a two uh, standard form two uh, one and the standard form Three. So how to convert it first of all? Okay. Okay. See that in the solution, uh, in the given equation, substituting capital Z, and then because here capital uh, small Z is the uh, converted to the eliminating, so that is equal capital Z. So capital Z is equal to small Z power n plus one when n is not equal to minus one, and capital Z is equal to log Z when n is equal to minus one and and अपने given equation लो n power is not equal minus one इन्दर कोडे then substituting capital Z is equal to z power n plus one in case n is equal to minus one इन्दर कोडे capital Z is equal to log Z ठीक है ना so that is equal to your assumption capital P and capital Q चुन्ने capital P is equal to दो capital Z by दो small x इन्दर अलग एक एक interchanging ये only small Z plus लो Capital Z replaces this number, so capital P is equal to two capital Z by two x, which is can be read d Z by d small Z into two Z by two x. d Z by small d Z means Z is equal to capital Z is equal to small Z function. Here, and the derivative of Z with respect to small Z into two Z by two x. And the because two Z two Z two Z cancel here, but the only d Z by d x is given. So that is equal to d Z by d Z into this is a Small p, oh na, this is a small p. That is equal to d capital Z by small d Z into small p. Okay. Similarly, capital Q is equal to so capital Q is equal to do capital Z by do y. So which is can be right d capital Z by d small Z into do Z by do y. So do Z by do y is equal to small Q gada. And d Z by small d Z. Into small q. So both values substituting the given equation. So after finding the differentiation of capital Z, substituting capital P and capital Q, we getting the uh, standard form one or three. Again same procedure. Continue finding the solutions. Okay na? This is the type two one. See the example here. First example solve non-linear partial differential equation z square into p square plus q square is equal to x square plus y square. That is equal to first of all given equation, but given equation of the form right in the form z power n into p and z power n into q converted that one. Okay now first of all that is equal which is can be write here only z square into p square. Oh na? So z square p square can be write in the form z p into all square. Function right x here inside minus x square. So and one side function is z power n p comma x and second outside is a function is function of y comma z power n into q. So see that the clear z p all square minus x square is equal to y square minus z z q all square. So that is equal to here. Uh, in this form f of x comma z power n p is equal to g of y comma z power n q with z power n z power n is equal in the given equation one one chudandi n is equal to one but which is not equal to minus one gada no again two cases here n is equal to minus one n is not equal to minus one here n is equal to one which is not equal to minus one okay that is equal substituting capital z is equal to small z power n plus one gada n is equal to one so that is equal to small z power one plus one. That is equal to small z square. And the capital Z is equal to small z square. Okay, now finding the differentiation with respect to z. 
ओके ना सो कैपिटल पी इज इक्वल एजम्शन डिफ्रेंशिएशन ऑफ जेड इज इक्वल टू जेड इज जेड इज का टू जेड नेक्स्ट कैपिटल पी इज इक्वल टू दो कैपिटल जेड बाई दो एक्स इज इक्वल विच इज कैन बी रेट डी कैपिटल जेड बाई डी जेड इंटू दो जेड बाई दो एक्स सो डी जेड बाई डी डी जेड इज इक्वल टू जेड इंटू पी दिस इज अ स्मॉल पी का दो जेड बाई दो एक्स स्मॉल पी सो जेड पी इज इक्वल टू कैपिटल पी बाई टू सिमिलरली कैपिटल क्यू इज इक्वल टू दो कैपिटल जेड बाई दो वाई इज इक्वल टू विच इज कैन बी राइट डी जेड बाई डी जेड इज इंटू दो जेड बाई दो वाई डी जेड बाई डी जेड इज इक्वल टू जेड इंटू स्मॉल क्यू देर फोर जेड क्यू इज इक्वल टू कैपिटल क्यू बाई टू सब्सटूटिंग जेड पी एंड जेड क्यू इन इक्वेशन वन सो दट इज इक्वल टू आफ्टर सब्सटूशन From equation one, after substitution, capital P by two whole square minus x square is equal to y square minus capital Q by two whole square, and uh, simplification is P square by four minus x square is equal to y square by y square minus Q square by four gada. So observing here, which is the function of standard form three gada, variable separable function of x comma P is equal to function of y comma Q. This is a standard form two. So now finding the solution of in standard form three. Sorry, standard form three variable separable. So which is assumption some constant here. Both values equal to some constant here assumption a square. No na. So this is a standard form three uh, assumption a square. So separating a square equating p square by four minus x square is equal to a and y square minus q square by four is equal to A square and now solving both equation p and q separating solving for p and q p is equal to and q is equal to right one so p is equal to two into square root of a square plus x square and q is equal to two into square root of y square minus a square so p q is a but we know that d capital z is equal to capital p d x plus capital q d y is a It assumption capital Z and small p small q in the standard form three the solution uh, d capital Z is equal to capital P d x plus capital Q d y is equal substituting capital P and capital Q here so there is equal substituting here capital P into d x capital Q into d y so now integration on both sides integration of d capital Z is equal to into integration of square root of h square plus h square into d x Plus two into square root of square root of y square minus a square into d y. That is equal to after integration capital Z is equal to two into so that is equal to here. Okay, that is equal to capital Z is equal to two into x by two into square root of x square plus a square. Plus a square by two into sine inverse of x by a plus two into so which is equal integration y by two into square root of y square minus a square it minus a square by two into cos h inverse y by a plus c. So two is a multiplication after completing the two. So but capital Z is equal to assumption capital Z is equal to a small z square here. So that is equal to a x into square root of x square plus a square. Plus a square sine inverse x by a plus y into square root of y square minus a square minus a square cos h inverse y by a plus c. This is the required general solution of given equation after converted to the standard forms. Okay, na? See the next example. So the equation z into p square minus q square is equal to x minus y. That is equal to your given equation, which is also converted in the form uh, z power n into p, z power n into q. That is equal to z p square here. But p square p power two, which is converted to whole square, and it's z power one. So that is equal can be read z power one by two p whole square and, right? So this is a Z four and P, 
so z4 1 by 2 into p whole square minus x is equal to and this is also zp zq square here and which is also converted z4 n the z4 1 by 2 z4 compulsor same under p coefficient to q coefficient to z4 must be equal the z4 1 by 2 this is also z4 1 by 2 q whole square so which is the standard equation of the form f of x comma z4 and p is equal to g of y comma z4 and q so that is equal to assumption here z is, uh, n is equal to here 1 by 2 1 by 2 is not equal to minus 1 okay no so that is equal to assumption capital z is equal to small z power n plus 1 that is equal to z power 1 plus 1 by 2 is equal to z power 3 by 2 and a capital z is equal to small z power 3 by 2 so dz by dz is equal to differentiation of 3 by z power 3 by 2 3 by 2 into z power 1 by 2 oh, no? so that is equal to capital P is equal to same similarly same procedure so though capital Z by X is equal which is can be right after differentiation 3 by 2 into Z power 1 by 2 P that is equal to Z power 1 by 2 P is equal to 2 by 3 into capital P similarly capital Q is equal to though capital Z by Y that is equal to dz by dz into dou z by dou y is equal to 3 by 2 into z power 1 by 2 q that is equal to z power 1 by 2 p that is equal to so that is equal to here z power 1 by 2 into q small q is equal to 2 by 3 into capital Q ok now substituting both values in equation 1 so after simplification uh, 2 by 3 capital P whole square minus x is equal to 2 by 3 capital Q whole square minus y. So, here eliminating z, you know, this is a form of the function, function of x and p is equal to function of y and q. This is a standard form 3, that is variable separable and, ok. Now, assumption which is equal to some constant a, 4 p square by 9 minus x is equal to 4 q square by 9 minus y is equal to a, a is a some constant, so separating, equating 4 p square by 9 minus x is equal to a, gada. so that is equal to capital P is equal to directly write down uh, 3 by 2 into square root of a plus x, capital Q is equal to 3 by 2 into square root of a plus y, separating and uh, solving for p and q directly and capital P is equal to and capital Q is equal to, since d capital Z is equal to capital P dx plus capital Q dy. So, substituting P and Q here, 3 by 2 into square root of A plus X into dx plus 3 by 2 into square root of A plus Y into dy. So, that is equal to after integrating on both sides, integration D capital Z is equal to integration of 3 by 2 square root of A plus X into dx plus 3 by 2 into square root of A plus Y into dy that is equal to here integration capital Z is equal to 3 by 2 into a plus x power 3 by 2 by 3 by 2 plus 3 by 2 into a plus y 3 power 3 by 2 by 3 by 2 so 3 by 2 is a cancel simplification is capital Z capital Z is equal to assumption z power 3 by 2 small z power 3 by 2 is equal to a plus x whole power 3 by 2 plus a plus y power 3 by 2 plus C. This is the required solution of the given partial differential equation after converted to the standard form. This is the type 2. So, that is one. Okay. Thank you. For more videos, please do subscribe my channel. Like and share it. Thank you.